welcome to i nurture with you on network value added services at the end of this video you will be able to discuss network value added services and list the advantages of network value added services each one of us at some time or the other needs to check our balance on our mobile phones or maybe certain services such as new alerts caller tunes and others how is this done depending on your service provider the quickest way to do this is to either call customer service or dial a number such as star 111 hash to reach your service provider what happens when you dial star 111 hash what you will see is a text message on your phone that reads ussd code running and in a short while you will receive the details about your balance and other services from your service provider the ussd code that you have entered into your phone is an example of a network value added service network value added services are used to deliver all types of value added services to mobile subscribers and enterprise subscribers Network value added services include unstructured supplementary service data interactive voice response system short messaging service center wireless application protocol and general packet radio service Let us now look at each of the other network value added services in more detail Consider that You have called your bank's customer care number to find out your account balance from your mobile phone. When you dial a customer care number, first the system will ask you to choose your preferred language, English or any other regional language by pressing 1 or 2 respectively. Let us say you want English as your language. You then press 1. The system will ask you to enter in your account and telephone personal identification numbers. Once you enter your account number and the telephone personal identification number, you will receive a message telling you your account balance. This is how balance inquiry works in mobile systems known as IVRS or interactive voice response system. Interactive voice response system is a software application that allows humans to interact with a computer through a voice telephone input. The system acts as a bridge between customers and the service provider's database. IVRS is also used in educational institutions, banking sector, customer care centers, information lookup, IT enabled services hotels airlines and train ticket inquiry and booking complaint booking and outbound calls in the telemarketing industry Another network value added service that is widely used in the telecom sector is short messaging service center or SMS center We are all familiar with SMS messages as it is the oldest and most commonly used method of mobile communication. SMS is a type of network value added service that facilitates the exchange of text messages between person to person or person to application. When you send a message first it will be stored in a short message center and then it is forwarded to the recipient. WAP is also an example of network value added service. WAP service enables you to retrieve information from the internet through mobile devices. Prior to the introduction of WAP, internet was used only on computers. Now, with the use of WAP, one can use internet and browse anywhere or anytime from their mobile phones, tablets and other wireless devices. Another popular and commonly used network value added service is GPRS. GPRS is a packet based service that transfers and receives data such as email and web browsing. G
GPRS enables us to take advantage of advanced features and services such as email on the move, multimedia messages, social networking and location based services. One of the main benefits of these technologies is that users are always connected to the internet. They are charged only for the amount of data transferred. Including IVRS, USSD, WAP and GPRS, there are various network value added services that are available in the mobile sector. Now that we have understood the various services, let us look at some of the advantages of network value added services. Network value added services improve the services of service providers. They increase the revenue of service providers. They generate higher subscriber satisfaction because of real time responses to subscribers request. They are a cost effective reliable method to deliver complete services to customers. Network value added services such as IVRS are used to handle large call volumes efficiently for an organization. Let us have a quick recap on what we have discussed. Network value added services are used to deliver all types of value added services to mobile and enterprise subscribers. Some of the network value added services are IVRS, USSD, WAP, GPRS, SMS service and others. Thank you for watching this video.